so there was a match I played today against uh, Protoss and uh, I want to show you some uh, really cheesy stuff and I really have no idea how to deal with this so it's like uh, I looked at that and I thought about how, how I, I ever would be able to defense this, uh, this shit. So it's like I skip this shit a bit. So it's like uh, I don't know, man. It's it's kind of overpowered, portable stuff. <laughs> uh, but I try to to show you the case. So I was starting with. The second base pretty early and um, focus on my war factory and um, I had no idea what's going on. <laughs> uh, and I was testing a bit uh, uh, not to focus on the benches to build the benches early and that was my mistake so normally I build tanks and some uh, vikings in the early uh, but I decided not to build any vikings and uh, my production was really slow uh, and I also focused it on the third base a lot of so my army production in the early was uh, pretty uh, less than efficient and this is also a point why I lost uh, this match. <coughs> so he also got scouts, he was about scouts, but not to stand. And then there is the first action where he actually flies with his warp prison into my base and then be like, port, <laughs> port the stuff. Uh, directly into the base. So it's like uh, fifth minutes and I don't know what to do. So uh, uh, doesn't see this coming and uh, then he is just in my base where I just moved my units to the third base to try to defend third base uh, <laughs> and then he completely squashes my workers. I was really slow, so it's like I just, I just was like, oh, five to ten seconds to see in the, in the brain. <laughs> and they are my first uh, Vikings. Probably the, the, the first issue is uh, if you play against Protoss, who does this, you may need some Vikings to actually fight the Swap Prisons. Uh, or uh, the second. Uh, if you if you not got the Vikings, you got uh, at least some Marines to defense here. Now, uh, but uh, imagine even when I got those Marines, those Seelats would just uh, uh, cut them into half. So it's more like uh, yeah, it's a bit annoying. <laughs> now we're in the six minutes, and normally I got a good armor, and a good army, but. So this was the first case. Uh, here comes the marinas in the total. So it's like uh, I got an, a lot of time, you know. So there was like uh, the war prison here, and I. And two tanks, a full bone car of marinas, and one Viking. And then when I would move them out to here, uh, this not happens. <laughs> but, uh, I was this low, so <laughs> I didn't expect it. You know, I didn't expect it. When you see my vision, I was like, mm, okay, two base, third base, let's defense uh, the third base here. Uh, 
and in this moment we are focused on the third base uh, he attacks <laughs> and totally screwed it up I uh, still was able to defend this And then uh, there was. Uh, he still got Swishin now at the time. So. And was the second issue, he just uh, did it again on, on the top side. So, moves here, places seal out and then rushes into the base and drop here. Here's some new moves. <laughs> I also tried to defend this. And then also drop here, Immortals. Like really cheesy, uh, and uh, some other stuff. So, I wonder what I can do as a Terran player against this. You know, I don't like, I, I can't really prepare for this. I can't really pre prepare when he lands his units here. Uh, so, I have to move back fast and, 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 and uh, defense this. And the second issue is the same, he just flies through the base and here inside here. So I got the options to get some Vikings to encounter uh, those warp prisms, but I did not really see an actual encounter for warp prism. Maybe you got an idea of that, how to encounter warp prism uh, spawns. <laughs> for me, it's absolutely horrible to play and, uh, against now uh, it's like like this, you know, <laughs> don't really know what to do, uh, you try to move your units, the units that are here on the base, uh, we'll remove it then, I didn't expect that he uh, that he reports twice. He reports one time and then reports another way. So it's like um, Christian Chief would to uh, destroy the first wave and then send out a Viking to destroy the war prison. Uh, and for the second issue, it's the same Vikings and uh, Vikings and uh, a good rotational army that maybe uh, groups here, and not here. So. Focus to to group my army here between those two points and that I get through the case of the third base now uh, with a bunker maybe so I place the second bump bunker maybe on the third base uh, that I have some time to move the units maybe when he decides to uh, attack the third base uh, and in the other case, when he spawns here, I have an, an, uh, enough time to move my units down here. Um, but it's it's a kind of cheesy scenario. I don't really know how to deal with it. So it's like, uh, <laughs> and that's how it is. Uh, the Protoss cheese of uh, those guys, those uh, wild prisons. Um, this player was a uh, platinum player, so he got a bit of uh, knowledge, and I just started to play StarCraft for two months now, so I'm really, really new in the game, and I always uh, was like, uh, every time there comes new cheese for me, I try to analyze it, what I, is it overpowered, can I, can I challenge it? And in this case, I review it and, and now I see I placed the army uh, to less efficient army production in first place. Secondary, uh, there's too much focus here. Then uh, I got horrible reaction skills, <laughs> and and uh, yeah, that's probably the point. So, a bit more army production. 
a bit more focusing here. Remove the broadcast and you know. But I try, I, I try. But whenever I, I focus on one point, it just moves into the parking lot prison and, and ports new enemies into my area. And they'll be like, what the fuck? <laughs> so it's like, um, yeah. So um, there was a, a bit confusion on my side with this lab prison. So in first place, I try in the future to build workings, Vikings, and focus the Vikings on chase the war prisons. And second, I try to uh, uh, deploy the army on this points on a rotation point, uh, and that's it, I guess. So that are my succession suggestions, <laughs> suggestions <laughs> to. Is. I don't know. Maybe you guys uh, got an idea what I can maybe do better uh, for the future. Uh, I just got those two points in my pocket. I don't know uh, what what to do better than uh, deploy army here and focus Vikings on those map works. <laughs> That's the only thing I, I, uh, I can imagine to do against. Uh, I give up. I got uh, still two bases with harvest, so it was not that bad, uh, and the income, my gas was pretty down here, so it's like, uh, <laughs> totally was confused, <laughs> it overruns me, uh, so it's like, yeah, uh, so this, this is about um, the, the cheese I got today, uh, and it was, uh, mostly about how to encounter barb prisons. So spot them fast, react fast, encounter them with Vikings, hunt them down, and deploy your army on positions where it actually can uh, rotate a bit. Uh, yeah. Uh, this is a bit tricky. This is one of my trickiest uh, situation to defend. So, um, yeah, that's that's the stuff for today.